Tides, the up and down movement of the oceans, are a result of three main forces. The influence of the moon, of the sun, and the rotation of the earth. The earth and the moon are mutually attracted by a gravitational pull. But inevitably, the point on the earth furthest from the moon is less drawn than the point closest to it. Plus, the gravitational force has an effect of stretching the earth, causing the sphere to deform and the waters of the oceans to produce twin tidal bulges or static tides. The effect of the sun is the same, but because of its considerably greater distance from the earth, the influence is only half as great as that of the moon. If the Earth, Moon and the Sun are in alignment, the effects are multiplied. And it is then that the highest tides, the spring tides, occur. But if the Earth, the Sun and the Moon are at right angles, their effects counter each other and produce the lower neap tides. All this is, however, influenced by the rotation of the Earth, whose main effect is on the time and place the tides occur. Thus, waves form on the ocean surface at varying heights. Currents, depth and the shape of the coastline will also determine the power of the waves, which helps to explain why tides are usually semi-diurnal, with two high waters and two low waters a day, while in some places there is just the one daily tidal cycle.